just got home from school. I went to Loaf and the Way and I got lunch for me and my brother because he's at home. So it's a lucky fuck has an inside day. Anyways, um, we're about to watch The Office while we eat our lunch. And then I need to go to the yard. And then I need to drive. And I'm literally having to pay my brother that we're at to come with me to pick up my horse's saddle because it's having its adjustments done. And I don't want to drive on my own because it's like a 40 minute drive and I'm a bit hashtag nervous. Um, yeah, so I need to do that. And then I'm going to have a really productive evening and work loads. Rate the lunch. I think I did a fab job. 10 out of 10. Um, it's a solid 8 out of 10. I'm really proud. I would say 7 because you didn't make it. Yeah, I'll give you that. Good evening. Just got out of the shower, obviously. <laughs> Look how steamed up my bathroom is. God, I forgot to turn the, like, ooh, I forgot to turn the fan on, so. Whoops, my room's all steamy now. Anyways, I had, oh my God, we had tacos for dinner tonight, which were amazing. Tacos are my favorite food ever. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, it's like, I just don't even know what time it is. I think it's like seven o'clock, but I've had a busy day. So I need to get on with work, but shall I show you my hair routine? I feel like I've low-key perfected it. I'm just putting in this which is leave-in conditioner, and oh my god, it kind of smells gross, I can't lie. Which, normally, their stuff smells really good. But whatever, it works really well, and it makes my hair, like, way more easy to brush through. But I got, when I went to my hairdressers, I got, um, got my hair falling out. I got new shampoo and conditioner, and oh my god, this has changed my life. I say that all the time, but it looky has. Wait, everything I use now, other than that conditioner thing, it's from Away because it's so good. I can get it from my hairdressers. But I use these two moisturizing hair bar for shampoo and then smoothing conditioner. Because I went through their whole website and like tried to find the ones that were like best for my hair because my hair is so frizzy and damaged because of all the heat I use. Anyways, so I got them and oh my god, genuinely. First of all, they smell amazing. And second of all, they've made my hair like so soft. I love it. My t-shirt's getting soaked. Anyways, and then I use, I only use this once a week. I used it today. It's the moisturizing hair mask, which is also from the way. And oh my God, it's so good, genuinely. They've made my hair like amazing. Okay, and then, is it literally all the way? Cause it's just so good. I literally never knew of it before my hairdresser started using it. I don't think they've always used it. They changed, anyways. And I used the glossy nectar, which I'm pretty sure is just like hair oil or I assume it is anyways and then I use ooh, the smoothing cream with it which is the same as the is it the same as the conditioner that I use I mean I assume so because they're both smoothing anyways and I mix them together and now I feel like I'm literally getting a haircut every time I wash my hair I feel so like bougie oh my god I'm so excited on Friday I'm going to see King No One um who are the best band ever i swear to god um with my brother and my dad it's gonna be so fun i'm genuinely so excited like me and my brother are absolutely obsessed with them they're so good and i genuinely can't wait my dad said they're like amazing live so i'm really excited i'm gonna finish getting ready and then i'm gonna have a really productive studying evening because my a levels are literally in eight weeks and i'm feeling very stressed but I'm trying not to like actually stress myself out because then I do no work. I just need to be really productive and like it'll be fine, you know? It'll be really good. <laughs> I always leave all my lip stuff in um, my bag and then I can never find it. <laughs> I feel like I might just get some more so that I can have like one for my like room and then one for my school bag. Although I am nearly done with school. Anyways, <gasps> oh my god. So <laughs> I had an awful returns thing so basically um i returned my or tried to return this fleece that i got from another version i think it was called i feel like i talked about this in my last video i can't remember anyway so i returned my package because i just like didn't like the fleece but i saw them on tiktok and someone was like oh they're like really good they're amazing whatever so i ordered from them obviously like i just didn't think it would be a problem i don't know i just didn't think about it and then i tried to return my package and i had the like, oh, I don't know what it's called. Returns, the thing like saying that I've returned it from Royal Mail. So like I had proof that I had returned it. Um, 
and then they just like wouldn't give me a return they were just like no sorry like we've not received your package even though i had proof anyways so then my dad had to email them to get my return for me and he did get it in the end so it was fine but they were like actually awful they were like loki refusing to give me a return so and then i looked them up on trustpilot and it is it trustpilot yeah that's what it's called and all the reviews were like yeah that's shit if you want to return had a really low rating so i was like oh whoops should have checked so yeah if you want to order from another version don't because they're fucking awful but like i don't think i've ever had a bad experience before like trying to return something i don't know this has never happened to me before but this is now i just think i'm always gonna get like tracked because normally i don't get tracked either i just return it and like i just don't even think about it i just like assume it will get there and hope for the best i guess but this time my dad returned it for me so he got um tracked and thank god because otherwise they probably would have not given me a return because i wouldn't have had proof because i think the only reason that i actually got my refund was like they couldn't not give it to me because i had proof that i had sent it but they were really fucking difficult about it anyways run over i'm gonna tidy my room make tea because I'm really craving tea at the moment, I don't know why. And then I need to revise. Ow, this is burning my hands. I'm gonna show you my candles before I start work. Okay, I've got these two, which, oh, oh my God, they smell so good. This is my favorite one. It's fireside. It's like really Christmassy, even though it's nearly summer, but I love it. And then this one. What is this? Yorkshire Rose and Sheer Lily. It's really good. I feel like they like go really well together. And then this one's the one I always get from Morton Brown. It's the orange and bergamot. And it's just like really good. And it smells like Christmas. finished maths that actually took me ages i thought it'd be really quick but it took me like a solid hour um okay i need to do economics i need to revise my notes because i don't really know my macro notes because we just had a mock but it was only on micro so i've literally only been doing that for like a solid month so i need to get on macro now um i was gonna do physics as well tonight but i'm thinking i'm probably not gonna have time for that it's already quarter to nine i want to try work till like 11 and then go to sleep <laughs> Perfect Sunday